Hey everyone, and welcome back to the multi-dimensional journey. Uh, this is Ayahuasca Car, me. And if you are returning to this channel, thank you so much for continuing to return and share your thoughts and your experiences. It's been awesome just to see this community to um, continue to grow. And if you are new to this channel, thank you so much for stopping by. Just so you know, this channel is all about spirituality, wellness, uh, mental health, non-ordinary states of consciousness exploration. And we talk a lot about ayahuasca on this channel. Uh, I'm a licensed therapist. I'm a soul coach and a self-taught breath worker. And today we're going to go over um, a certain kind of breath work technique. And I'm really excited to share it with you. Um, it's really about creating an anchor internally inside of us to come back to over and over again to increase our somatic awareness and also to quiet our minds. But then also we take that anchor later on in the exer exercise and we learn to expand our energy. And this is really to represent um, the contraction of our mental and emotional and physical bodies at times, and then also the expansion of our mental, emotional, and physical bodies at times. So oftentimes we're playing with this contraction and expansion, whether the contraction is chosen, we're choosing to maybe wind down or de-stress, or sometimes contraction happens in really uncomfortable moments, like when we're triggered or really stressed out. Um, and then expansion happens uh, maybe when we're feeling more open, more social, more um, feeling our spiritual pride, feeling our manifestation powers, feeling our energy extend out beyond us, whether that is in the physical form or in our mental or emotional forms. So the exercise is quite simple, but quite powerful. So what you wanna do is um, I'm sitting on a meditation cushion and you can do this laying down or sitting straight up. For today, I'm gonna sit straight up. Um, I do recommend that you choose a playlist of music that's binary beats focused or something that's almost methodically trance. Um, slow, but it's going to put you into that state of calm and ease, yet uplift you. So I will leave um, a link below, uh, a Spotify link for some songs that I recommend so you can get an idea of what I'm talking about. But often when I'm doing this, I will pop in my earbuds and allow the uh, music to take over. Music is such a catalyst for me when it comes to my breath work. It allows me to drop into the experience um, almost immediately. So really recommend that you pair this exercise that I'm going to show you um, with some music that you have chosen for yourself. So what we're going to do is we're just going to do really slow, connected, conscious breathing here in and out through the mouth. And we are breathing into the belly all the way up into the chest and then slowly releasing so this is how you will start and this is how you will build in the beginning but the anchor is your stomach the anchor is the belly breath and the anchor being anytime you notice you get distracted in your mind or um, you know noises outside of you or anything that's happening outside of you and your attention wants to be drawn <clears throat> or your energy <coughs> excuse me your mental emotional or physical energy wants to be drawn you will just simply come back to that breath okay so we will start here Yeah, I just take a taking an inhale since I'm coughing up something. So, um, so you'll breathe in and out through the mouth, nice and easy. And out through the mouth. And you just want to continue this pace for about two to three minutes. So 
So as you're doing this, you cannot see my belly, but for you guys at home or wherever you're watching this, you're going to literally fill up your belly like a balloon and have that line of air go all the way up to your chest and then exhale. So it's about a five count in, five count out. Just like that. And as you're doing this process, like I said, if you notice your mind begins to wander, no, that's totally okay. The thing we're wanting to get into is really the body. So you want to really begin to notice the body as you're breathing, as you continue to breathe. Really feeling that physical anchor in your stomach and really focusing on connecting with that. And as you drop more and more into the body, you'll begin to notice how your body is talking to you. Like maybe you have some tension in your shoulders and so maybe that's an invitation to just roll that out. Or maybe you feel there's some tension in your stomach. So an invitation just to relax that a little bit more. Um, Whatever you're feeling in your body, you can kind of, you know, breathe into it. And this is really, really good work in itself as you listen to um you learn how to listen to pay you learn to listen to the subtleties of how your body's talking to you and ultimately you're um you're doing a practice called tracking which is often used um in a lot of somatic approaches and a lot of mindfulness approaches so by just doing this breath and using the belly breath as the anchor, you're also tapping into the ability to just be more and more aware of your body. So we'll do just a couple more breaths here. Relaxing more and more into it. Beautiful. And when you're doing this on your own, you can do this for as long as you want. I end up doing this part for about seven minutes straight while the music is playing and just building up that anchor, that strong physical repetition of the breath and learning how to tune into the subtleties of my body. And then once I feel pretty satisfied with that, I start doing this circular movement with my body. So I'm kind of just moving my torso outward and then inward. Once again, reflecting that expansion as I go out this way and then contraction. So from here, we want to use the energy of how we just, you know, created that anchor. And then we want to almost spread it all around and allow that anchor to go beyond our body. And while we're doing this, we're still breathing. So breathing in and then out as we go back. So I'm taking that anchor and almost externalizing it with my body. One more time. Take a nice little pause there. So oftentimes we want to know how to command our own energy or how to manage it or just how to notice it. And by playing with, okay, where's my internal energy at? How can I cultivate that? And how can I get to know that part of myself and something I can come back to over and over again? which is also known as a resource. And then how can I take that energy and bring it outside of me? And how can I feel that through movement, right? And, you know, sometimes 
these movements are so subtle so it's like maybe it doesn't seem to have a big impact and I want to invite you that I guarantee by slowing down and really paying attention by really noticing once again these subtleties you'll be able to take them into um, more busy atmospheres more like for example whether it's a busy atmosphere internally you know with stress or our minds kind of get chattery or we have negative thinking patterns happening or when that busyness is happening outside of us maybe there's a lot of people and there's like a lot going on and then all of a sudden you feel overstimulated and over your threshold right so knowing that you can go back to that internal anchor of that just really subtle right to regulate internally to know that i can command my own energy and feel safe in my body and know that i know what's happening and then i can also play with the motion of like what does it feel like to spread that energy or move it you can also go the other way too by the way so like i said i really recommend that you do this um with music that way you can really kind of like feel and kind of dip more into that autonomic nervous system and once again disconnect from that chatty mind um and then the other part of this you know the circular part can be done for another seven minutes so it can be as short or as long as you want totally up to you for me doing uh things in seven seven minute time frame seems to really work for me but you can do it shorter or longer. Um, and I would love to hear about your experiences by putting this all together and um, hearing what you personally went through. Um, there are so many different kinds of, you know, breath work routines, mindfulness routines. Um, and I hope this one today kind of inspired you to play with, you know, your own internal resourcing and how you can bring that internal resource externally. So please share below, comment, um, and if you have any questions, also please drop those below. And just so you know, I put out videos every Tuesdays and Thursdays. If you have any recommendations for topics or any requests, you can email me directly. I'll put my email below, or you can also comment in the discussion section of the channel, and I'll be sure to check that. So thank you so much for stopping by today, and as always, remember why you came here.